Have you ever stopped to ponder why the political climate seems to be more polarized than ever before? It's a complex question, but let's delve into it by examining the two major political parties in the United States, the Democrats and the Republicans. Today, we'll explore five reasons why you might consider voting Republican over Democrat. Firstly, let's focus on the economy. Historically, Republicans have championed policies that support economic growth and stability. They advocate for lower taxes and fewer regulations, allowing businesses to thrive and create jobs. In contrast, Democrats often favor more government intervention, which can lead to increased taxes and regulations. This could potentially stifle growth and discourage entrepreneurial ventures. Secondly, consider the stance on national security. Republicans are typically seen as strong defenders of the nation's security. They support robust defense spending, often argue for stricter immigration policies, and work to maintain a strong military. Democrats, on the other hand, tend to prioritize diplomacy over defense spending, which could potentially leave the nation vulnerable. The third reason centers on individual freedoms. Republicans value the principle of small government, believing that less government intrusion allows for greater personal freedom. They champion the rights of individuals to make decisions without excessive governmental interference. Democrats, however, often advocate for larger government roles in citizens' lives, which some argue can limit personal freedoms. Fourthly, let's discuss the approach to healthcare. Republicans generally favor a free market approach, believing competition can drive down costs and improve quality. They argue that individuals should have the freedom to choose their healthcare providers. Democrats, conversely, often support a more socialized approach to healthcare, which could potentially lead to longer wait times and less choice for patients. Lastly, consider the perspective on education. Republicans often promote school choice, allowing parents to decide the best educational pathway for their children. This contrasts with Democrats who generally support a more standardized approach to education, potentially limiting parental choice and flexibility. In conclusion, we've explored five key areas where Republicans and Democrats differ. The economy, national security, individual freedoms, healthcare, and education. Each party has its strengths and weaknesses, but it's clear that Republicans offer a unique approach that prioritizes economic growth, strong national security, personal freedom, competitive healthcare, and flexible education options. Remember, the goal is not to polarize, but to enlighten. It's crucial to consider these points when casting your vote. After all, it's your voice, your vote, and your future at stake.